Hi, I'm going to be talking to you today about my Liana Vocal AI, made in the same way as I made the Yulia Volkova AI, using Sovitz SVC. Liana's AI seems to be a little bit more responsive and also conducive to a more American accent when speaking. After about 20,000 steps with, I believe, also around 67 samples, it seems to perform pretty well. If it performs sufficiently well enough for me, I may make a full tutorial rather than just talking and showing some results of the AI. But, um, just to... If I were to sing some songs off the top of my head, Yeah, It actually it works fairly well. What are some other songs I can think of off the top of my head? Must need a gun yet! Must need a gun yet! Только скажи, дальше нас двое, за облака, за облаками, нас не найдут, нас не изменят. And the reason it actually works so well for singing is from using the studio acapellas from Tattoo's various releases from I would say 1999 to maybe 2006, as well as Yena Katina released some stems from her latest productions. And she released them in dry form, so I was able to use them. So this model is pretty up to date and produces a really convincing emulation of her voice, especially since she speaks so naturally in English. It's also more suited for someone with a lower vocal range, at least in terms of speaking, without having to change the pitch settings to, um, well, having to change the pitch settings to like six or seven, so it works pretty well for recording situations. If I were to do like a scale or something, like, it does a pretty decent pitch recognition, the AI actually does really well. However, I will note that it does struggle with, say, if you were to do the same vowel in a run, it seems to confuse A, E, and A uh, as the same sounds. But this is not absolutely insurmountable, you may just have to record and say like, ah. Uh. Ah, 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 and do it like so, and um, I'm actually, I'm not listening to myself as I'm recording, so I have no idea how that sounds, I'll find out how it does in post, and then I guess have to re-record if it sucks, but there are different workarounds for the different problems that you may experience, and I'm going to keep training the model as I go, and I'll, I'll let you know my experience. Um, I believe you can find some acapellas of your own to work with on allmylove.net. I just happen to have this laying around, but back to what I was talking about. And I uh, was again like my last video, I actually did not realize I was training the Liana AI at the same time as the Yulia AI. So I didn't know why it was taking so long for me to train Yulia up to 20,000 steps. I didn't realize I was also training Liana. However, Liana lagged a little bit, perhaps because the clips were quite a bit longer. I don't even think that I manually cut them to a certain length, I just cut the unwanted noises out. Um, there are still some mysteries that I don't really understand about, so if it's SVC and some problems I was experiencing, like whenever I was seeing a long note, it would dip in volume, making it virtually impossible to sing with it. However, I found that by increasing, if I go to Sovitz SVC now, I open my graphical interface, increasing the block seconds increases the delay with which the AI will actually respond with sound. However, it's much better for post process of real time speech. You're going to want shorter block seconds. I don't expect that you're going to be singing the same note in, um, in just a normal speaking Discord situation. However, when you are Actually singing the song, you're going to want the block seconds to be quite high and then just edit it to be in time and post. Honestly, I think I have everything I ever wanted. I may release models to Google Drive somewhere or like make a Discord. But I'll let you guys know. Beyond that, I think that's all I have to say about the Liana AI. Um, there was no particular need to make this. Liana has not had any difficulties with her voice, it seems, throughout the year. She seems to be singing great. There's no need to replace damaged vocal cords with AI vocal cords so to speak. 
But I mean, it could be used as like kind of a trip back in time, discounting the one or two modern acapellas I was able to feed the engine. Her voice sounds almost exactly the same, if not better, somewhat silkier now. If I release the models, I will release them in the description and let you know. For everyone else who checked out my thread on Reddit, thank you so much. All of your comments and messages, I really appreciate it. I hope you have a great day.